Will you kiss a woman after she's gone down on you? Nope. Ah. She can like rinse her mouth or brush her teeth or whatever, but wow, it's oh called it's called a boundary. Interesting. Okay. okay, so are you agreeing, Andrew? You don't go down on women either. I didn't say that. I, I said that if a woman were to go down on a dude, you ain't kissing her afterwards. It's gross. It's, it's your Why? penis. If it's your yeah, wife. I don't give a oh. Yeah, no. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are good. Guys, today we're going to be reacting to. This girl doesn't respect friends' boundaries and shame him for them. Guys, this one is big, so let's just go down to it. Will you kiss a woman after she's gone down on you? Nope. Ah. She can, like, rinse her mouth or brush her teeth or whatever, but... Wow. It's called, it's called a boundary. Interesting. Okay. okay, so are you agreeing, Andrew? You don't go down on women either? I didn't say that. I, I said that if a woman were to go down on a dude, you ain't kissing her afterwards it's gross it's, it's your Why? penis if it's your yeah, wife I don't give a sh no. yeah no no really? but you do go down on women though <laughs> i would get a you better get a <laughs> toothbrush <laughs> no way y'all are babies what's that i said that's babyish i'm not gonna what's your hold body up, count hold on, hold on. how about instead of you two whispering under your breath why don't you actually say it into the microphones? Yes, because please. Because it's so unserious. I, I said, so you've never done a swap. Okay. Yeah, what did you say? I said this feels like high school. Why does it feel like high school? Because it feels like you make a statement and then he agrees. Andrew he disagrees. Statement, and Andrew, agree. I think Andrew, Andrew like, disagrees with me on plenty of things. Goes down on women. It, he didn't object like, to that one. Yeah, he just doesn't like to be kissed after his wife goes on. Right. Him. Whatever. But I felt like those are like very high school things to say because that's just inexperienced. How does it? Oh, no, it's just inexperienced. Like, oh, you know what I need that. to do? I need to walk a guy through a mall. The body. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I kind of agree with the guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> because if you go down, you know, no, no, kiss me there. I'm sorry. It feels. Oh damn! No, no, no! Ew! That. No, wait, I was saying that. I, I, I don't know. I don't it's know. Just but ew. I don't know. But from what, I'm, what I've heard, I feel like I don't know. It's kind of how do I put it? For some people, it's like it depends on the moment and how you guys are. It does not matter if it's my cushion, but no, don't kiss me. I don't know. It depends but, on the moment. It depends on how you guys are. But, but I kind of see why it's weird because they use their mouth. It's weird. I don't know. For some people, maybe, maybe if, I'm if you have this, if you have this, if you have this talk, I feel like this is a very nice talk. I'd like us to bring on our podcast because if you have this um, debate with um, some people, they 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 kind of see it like for it to be to be really good because um, I have friends who like like who like to kiss and then. I, I don't know. That's why I say like it, sh it depends on the moment you guys are having. I, I know it's weird, it's irritating, but I don't know. It just yeah, it depends. depends on the moment. You see, it when depends. it comes to sexual stuff, we don't look at it. When you are doing it, it's not logical. Yeah. It's but when you are talking about it and talking about it, it, and talking about it, it, it's it feels logical. logical. But when you are in the app, it's different. So it depends on the moment. But like I thought about it. You see, I thought about it. Then it felt no, like anything. It felt. I feel like anything. Anything sexual related, like there has to be an sounds, sounds irritating to me. Some, some things. Especially coming from some certain. But he himself, he said he does not go down on a woman, the Brian guy. So if you don't go down on a woman, don't expect her to go down on you. Bro. For you, I don't want to see. I'll, I'll have, In that part, don't I've had it seen so many times. Don't I've had so, it seen so many times. Definitely, you enjoy it if someone goes down on you. Men that don't. I don't um, like going down on women. They love when women go down on them. I, I actually feel it's quite it's not. I actually feel like most times the women may not complain. Oh, no. They may come onto we, their friends, oh, to talk about it. To but it just doesn't look fair because I feel don't like to me, to me, guys. if you if you can do something to oh, someone, no. you should be able I'm to return. If I don't get some out of <laughs> but guys, let's get right back. Thank you. And then I can get the sufficient experience to get the clap like you did. And one of these From days, we will be on par with each other, to but it's my not what you did. Who cheated, though, so, okay. Ooh, All right, he got you on that one. He got well, you so, how, is it, how would it have anything to do with inexperience? 
Well, I'm just, I mean, I'm sure maybe, have you had a bad experience eating Is that why? I'm sorry, should I not say that? No. I, oh, I've, I did it a couple times when I was younger, but I quickly, I honestly, I wish I never did it. Was it unsanitized? No, it had nothing, okay. it had absolutely nothing to do with that. There's nothing was no wrong with the going on. nothing wrong with the <laughs> I actually learned at a very young age, somehow I discovered this in 2008, uh, maybe it was, I don't know exactly when, uh, so the so HPV men are experiencing very high uh, incidence of throat and head cancer, mm -hmm. uh -huh. and this is directly linked to uh, HPV. And this is uh, so. Wh who's that famous actor? Is it was it Martin Sheen? Uh, no, Can you Google it? Uh, but uh, a lot of men are getting throat and throat and head cancer yeah they should have gotten the vaccine well for the longest time it wasn't recommended in men it's only now recently that they've started recommending men get the hpv vaccine hmm. so i'm not gonna get i mean i already regret having done it those couple times when i was much younger but yeah i'm not getting throat cancer for your gratification sorry if that makes me high school and inexperienced, <laughs> I ain't doing that shit. You're so sassy. Sassy. So sassy. Nick, can you find it, please? <laughs> He's married to, um, I'm trying to think of This guy him. got throat cancer. Famous, I think it's Martin Sheen. He got it from eating Yes. Is awesome. it higher percentage of, like, men getting that throat is? cancer yeah. than, like, a girl? Yeah. That's where Tony Montana got his famous yes. scar as well. He got his famous scar mm. from doing that. Damn. Mm. Like, is it actually more common in men? I'm genuinely curious. But if your wife, I, I think if your, your wife isn't is sleeping around, men, though. How would usually you get have like? Doesn't it not show up on men like that? Well, or they can have like they can have like no symptoms. More more women are vaccinated against against it, and um, I don't know the exact breakdown, but it does seem to be this uh, does seem to be manifesting itself more in men. Yeah. Michael Douglas. Was that the guy in Wall Street? Or what was that fucking movie? I don't know. One of these fucking famous actors. <laughs> Can you pull up? The chat probably knows. Can we just pull up the chat? Uh, yeah, so. That's where the real Michael roasting's Douglas. happening. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even want to read it. I know, right? Um, but yeah, Actually, no, it's, it's uh, funny. And I got neck problems, too. So, you know, I'm not trying to. I mean, you're entitled That's to your that. sexual boundaries, dude. Yeah. It's fine. Yeah, I'm not trying to argue that you're wrong for that. I just... You yeah. literally were. It's, I didn't and say And this girl that, over it here, it's so high school. Like, it seems a little high school. Like, that's something that I feel have you like ever a had sex? kid would say. No. What if... Uh, okay. Have you ever had sex? I'm assuming this is yes, but... A couple <laughs> times, it's not really, like, my favorite. <laughs> okay. It's not my favorite. Has a guy ever asked you to have sex? Uh, yeah. Yeah, into the mic. Okay. Yeah. Why didn't you want to have it? Because I just it's don't not want anything in my butt. Okay, cool. <laughs> this is a no no zone for me. Yeah. It's a boundary, right? How would you feel if a guy didn't respect that boundary? Then it would technically be rape. So. Oh my God. Don't say <laughs> the what word. I can mean, but okay. <laughs> it's fair to have whatever oh boundary God. you have. It's totally fine. But I wasn't saying that was high school. I was just saying you guys like. You say one thing, he Just agrees. He's, but, yeah. Look, but he disagreed. No, though. no is a complete he, he sentence. I don't want you know, to. Like is he said enough. something, and then I yeah. disagreed with him, and then we agreed on the things that we agree about. It's, it's almost like it's adult conversation. I know it's terrible. It's like, like high school, though. I just wanted to because. know the reason, and now that I know the reason, that there's not like a oh, like thank or some kind of like just wrong. Reason How about the fact it. that women are promiscuous and not, there's no scenario where I'm going to go down <laughs> on a girl who there's a possibility she just f***ed a guy the night before. How about that too? Uh, yeah. He's not wrong. Not into that. It's, it's mm -hmm. or who, Some guys may not want to go down on a chick who has armpit hair. I mean, <laughs> exactly. Yeah. It seems seems right. reasonable. Uh, what's the other? Sorry guys, a whole bunch came through. I haven't been paying attention to it. Okay. Uh, because basically it's just like Because you don't know where your partner has been. You get. 
to but if you're married i think really is not going to because you trust your partner Obviously. regardless of the fact if maybe they are cheating or not you are not aware of it so you have to trust them they shouldn't even be and cheating no i'm just like saying it basically yeah. and then you have to speak with them with that protection because you trust them and you know that that your partner may be on best control or something so it's the same thing about the head stuff like that is bad if you don't speak to school but i feel i don't know if you expect someone to be given but if you are okay with not giving and not getting then it's okay there are other plenty of things to do with bed as so well yeah that's not really matter about what i i actually like what brian said about boundaries because i feel like if you say that okay you say you don't like this thing let's say we are married now and then you tell me oh babe i don't like this particular thing you know sexually and then i'm like okay fine because i know you don't like that thing i'm not gonna ask for it we're not gonna do it but i just feel like you, you see my only problem when it comes down to this is because um men say they don't like to go down women but they want women to go down them that is where i draw the line yeah that that's it that's it for me that just if you're not doing you don't get it because mm-hmm. you don't you obviously it's like you want your no, that no, you boundary want to be respected you, you won't want so to like get it. you shouldn't be as asking long as for what you can't give it you yeah, don't, you don't expect you someone to give it to you. That, that's it for I'm, me. I mean, if yeah. I know I don't want to go down to someone, I won't expect you to go down on me. But if you do it, that's simple. If you do it on your own, that's your business. Because I won't go down. <laughs> <laughs> I find that in. Well, it's ill. <laughs> but I, I I'm just sorry. feel like everybody. I have to be married should... to you for me to think about. <laughs> I didn't no, know think about like it. I have to actually be married to you if you want to do something like that. It's too. Right now, I think kissing someone is too intimate. <laughs> kissing, kissing, kiss. No, it's too it's intimate. I'm sorry. Intimate. It's I'm, too not, intimate. I don't know I'm not going to swallow like your saliva just because I'm having fun. It's too intimate. You can get tuberculosis from it. You can get <laughs> People, it's too people intimate. Don't, I can't. People don't see kiss as anything. No, I just no, like, no, I can't even kiss someone. If I just look at you and I'm like, nah, I'm not doing this. I'm sorry, but I'm not doing this. I feel like if I don't like you, like you, like you, it's that extent. I just can't because it's actually very, very easy. It's, I'm, very I'm going to exchange saliva with you. Why would I do that with you just because we're having fun? So, guys, like, be careful and be safe out there. Don't talk of going down on you, like, seriously. Oh, <laughs> damn it. But, well, guys, this was, this was fun. This was fun. And um, I think, like, just coming for me, like, people should learn to respect other people's boundaries and at the same Have time. One pack. Yes, please stop sleeping around. I feel like if you actually this goes out to marry me, if you're married and you're watching this right now and you're cheating, please, please, um, like stop. How do I put this? If you know that, stop giving your wife some affection. Except for that, if you know that you want to, you see, it's different when you know that you are a playboy and you just cannot be with one woman. Then why get married? Then why are you getting married? It's not just even about married people. Why are you having a girlfriend when you can talk to so why many you girls in a committed every relationship single day? If you are going to act like you're not committed, you can talk to different girls every day and do your thing. So why do you have to ask this particular person? You see, and one thing you don't know is that okay, men say that girls, girls, um, she say yes. lot. This that this that there are girls who are so committed that once you are their man, you are their man. That's it. They don't know any other. You see. They will try to avoid some kind of conversations with other with other guys. Do you get? So I don't know why. See, if you want to be a fuck boy, be a fuck boy. Do not. You want to be a fuck girl. Not stay. Let's not yeah. be you stop, guys. Stop. <laughs> because it seems that girls are like. But it goes <laughs> to both genders. Stop um, caging people. I'll use the word caging. Person is not playing with But either way, guys. And also, do not ask for what you can't give. That's all. But this was fun. Please. Um, <laughs> <laughs> please leave your comments in the comment section we'd like to see what uh, what you guys think about this and don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel i love you guys Bye.